Imagine a world where every need is met, a world where there is abundant food, water, and shelter for everyone. To many people, this is the perfect definition of utopia. Well, this is not the case as proved in the Universe 25 experiment conducted by American ethologist John Calhoun in 1968. The Universe 25 experiment shocked the world and was termed as one of the most terrifying experiments in the history of science, designed to study the effects of overpopulation and social stress. Biologist John Calhoun built a rat colony at the National Institute of Mental Health in Maryland in 1968. It was a large pen of four and a half foot cube with everything a mouse could ever desire, plenty of food and water, a perfect climate, reams of paper to make cozy nests, and 256 separate apartments accessible via mesh tubes bolted to the walls. Calhoun also screened the mice to eliminate disease. Free from predators and other worries, a mouse could theoretically survive to an extraordinarily old age there without a single worry. Talk of the perfect rat utopia. Initially, the mouse population thrived. Within months, their numbers grew exponentially. The population soared from 8 to 2,200 mice, doubling roughly every 55 days. But as the population increased, the perfect society began to fracture. The mouse heaven soon started deteriorating into a mouse hell. With overcrowding came unexpected changes. Mice became increasingly aggressive and territorial. Social bonds weakened, and once normal interactions turned hostile. Females exhibited more aggression, neglecting their offspring and isolating themselves. These once nurturing mothers began abandoning their young, leading to a steep decline in the birth rate. The nests that were once filled with life turned into places of neglect and death. Then emerged the beautiful mice, males who withdrew from social interactions entirely. They refused to mate or fight, dedicating their time to grooming, eating, and sleeping. These males, with their pristine coats and flawless appearance, were stark contrast to the chaos surrounding them. They became obsessed with self-care, showing an almost pathological level of grooming, and avoided any social engagement. As these behaviors spread, reproduction rates plummeted. Juvenile mortality soared to 100%. The mice stopped reproducing altogether. Despite the abundance of resources, the population's social fabric unraveled. Homosexuality and cannibalism emerged, and the once thriving colony spiraled into extinction. Cannibalism became rampant, even though food was plentiful. It was as if the mice had lost all sense of purpose and normalcy. John Calhoun repeated this experiment 25 times, each with the same result, social collapse and extinction. But what does this mean for us, for human society? The Universe 25 experiment provides haunting insights into the effects of overpopulation and social stress. First, the experiment proved that overpopulation can lead to social breakdown. As seen from the experiment, increased density results in heightened aggression, social withdrawal, and the erosion of social bonds. For humans, overcrowded cities can induce similar stress, leading to societal issues such as increased crime, mental health problems, and weakened community ties. Second, the importance of designing livable spaces cannot be overstated. Urban planners must consider psychological well-being, ensuring access to personal space, green areas, and opportunities for social interaction to prevent the negative effects of overcrowding. In urban environments, creating spaces that foster community interactions and provide relief from the stresses of city life is essential. Parks, communal areas, and thoughtfully designed housing can make a significant difference in maintaining social harmony. Third, maintaining social cohesion and strong community structures is essential. Humans are inherently social beings, and isolation or neglect can lead to severe psychological distress. Policies that foster community building, mental health support, and social engagement are crucial. Building a sense of belonging in community can combat the isolation that often accompanies densely populated areas. Programs that encourage social interaction, support mental health, and build community resilience are vital. Lastly, resilience and adaptability are key. Unlike the mice, humans possess more complex social structures and coping mechanisms. However, proactive measures are needed to address social and environmental stresses effectively. We must invest in mental health resources and support systems that can help individuals cope with the pressures of modern life. Encouraging social adaptability and resilience can help prevent the kind of social decay observed in Universe 25 experiment. The story of Universe 25 experiment serves as a stark reminder of the potential consequences of neglecting social and psychological well-being in the face of population growth. By learning from this experiment, 
we can strive to create societies that prioritize mental health, social cohesion, and sustainable living. This means not only addressing the physical needs of populations, but also fostering environments where individuals can thrive socially and psychologically. As we move towards increasingly crowded urban centers, the lessons from Universe 25 experiment become ever more relevant. We must focus on creating spaces that support healthy social interactions and individual well-being. By doing so, we can avoid the pitfalls of overpopulation and ensure that our societies remain vibrant and resilient. Thank you for watching. If you found this video insightful, please like, share, and subscribe for more explorations into the fascinating intersections of science and society. Together, we can learn from the past to build a better future.